Hi, we are given a Kelly table consists of the element 1, 3, 7, 9, 11, 13, 17, 19 with a binary operation star. We are going to find for each element G, find the order of G. 1 is the identity, therefore 1 has order 1. How about element 3? 3 has order 4 because 3 to the power 1 is 3. And then 3 power 2 is 3 star 3, we get 9. Then 3 power 3 is 3 star 3 star 3, which is 9 star 3, and you get 7. And 3 power 4 is 3 star 3 star 3 star 3, which is 7 star 3, you get 1. So 3 power 4 is 1. Therefore, 3 has order 4. 7 has order 4 because 7 is the inverse of 3, as 3 times 7 is 1. How about other elements? Let's look at 9. 9 has order 2. This is because 9 power 2 is 9 star 9 is 1. How about 11? 11 also has order 2 because 11 square, which is 11 star 11, is also 1. How about 19? This is order 2 because 19 star 19 is 1. So we are left with 13 and 17. Now, 13 has order 4 because 13 power 1 is 13. Okay, 13 star 13 is 9. How about 13? Power 3, 13 star 13 star 13 is 9 star 13, 9 star 13 in this case is equal to 17. Then how about 13 power 4, 13 star 13 star 13 star 13 is equal to 17 star 13 is 1. So therefore, 13 raised to the power 4 is 1. So 13 has order 4. Then we also claim 17 as order 4 because 17 is the inverse of 13. After we've done all this calculation, we can make our table of x, order of x, and write down the order of each element. 1 has order 1, 3 has order 4, 7 has order 4, 9 has order 2, 11 has order 2, 13 has order 4, 17 has order 4, 19 has order 2. Now, the last part, the which group G over H, if H is a side group generated by 19, is isomorphic to. First of all, H is normal in G as G is abelian. That is commutative. As SH equal to HX now, the left coset and right coset are equal. How many cosets are there? The index of, G, of H in G is G over H there. It's 8 over 2 because the size of H is 2. So 8 over 2, we have 4. So there are 4 distinct cosets. So G, question group of G over H, consists of 4 cosets, and they are H, 3H, 9H, 7H. How do I get this? And you can verify that there are actually 4 distinct left cosets. And these are the 4 distinct left cosets. Now in fact, you start with G, 3H, you start with 3H and generate the whole quotient group by multiplying 3h by itself. For example, 3h times 3h is 9h. 3h times 3h times 3h, you get 9h times 3h, which is 7h. And then 3h times 3h times 3h times 3h, you get 7h times 3h now. And 7h times 3h, you get 1h. So the quotient group is agreed with four elements. So the quotient group g over h is must be isomorphic to the second group of order 4, Z4, where H is the second group generated by 19. That is the end of the recording.